For this one, we need to find the final price. There's two ways to do this. On number 16, I'm going to do it both ways. So if you guys did it either way, that's fine. But if you don't do it your way the first time, then just wait. We're going to do it your way the second time. So let's take a gander at this one. So I'm going to set up my percent proportion on this. So I got 100%. For some of you guys, you just looked at the decrease, which was 21%, and put that in. That's fine. And uh, the regular price, which would represent 100% of the actual price, is 9.65. And we want to find the new 21% off. So to solve this one, we use the fishy method, or you can if you want. Bow tie, fishy, hybrid. Bow tie, whatever. So that would be 9.65 times 21 divided by 100 and that would give me I rounded this to 2.03 because specifically we're talking about monies right here so this two dollars and three cents is not the answer though yeah. this is just how much it decreased by so to find the actual answer we've got to take that 965 the regular price and subtract the two dollars and three cents and that would give me $7.62 is the final price. So that is our actual answer. Now again, this is just the first way to do it. We're going to show you guys the second way. And then you guys get to decide which way you like the best in order to solve this. All right, so now I'm going to set up another percent proportion. Again, this is a different way that I, you could do it. Since it's a 21% decrease, this means that you would have paid 100 minus 21% of the price, which turns out to be 79% of the overall price. So the new percent now is 79, not 21. Now the 79% is the new price, which will go right account. And we don't know what that value is, so 100% of the price, though, will continue to be in the denominators, which is the regular price, $9.65. We will be solving for X. So once again, using bow tie fishy method, you can use cross multiplication if you choose, but this would be $9.65 times the 79 percent and divided by the 100 gives me bam I get seven dollars and sixty two cents which I think is what we got before all right on the next few problems uh, we'll look at a way at, at the problem then you guys will tell me which way you prefer and that is what we will do. Either way works, so you're not required to do it any specific way on the test. 